Now, don't get me wrong, I've not been to all, right? So I've been to Everton, um, United, obviously Watford, Southampton, Tottenham, Arsenal, Leicester, <sighs> Wolves, Chelsea, West Ham, Newcastle, Brighton, Palace. So I haven't been to all, but I've seen them on like telly. So we're going to start <clears throat> with Everton. <clears throat> I'm tempted to put them in awful. The reason why, and I know they're moving to like Docks, Doxley or something like that. Um, but there's poles, which you know I hate. It just looks old. I'm sorry. Anyway, next up. Bournemouth's going to go in terrible. It's so small. You can only fit like 100 or 200 away fans. Like it's, the away end sells out in about an hour of it being... Not even that of being out. <clears throat> so, like, it's not great. Man U, I'm going to put it in brilliant. Um, it's very big. There's a like a football museum in there. It's incredible. <laughs> Leicester, I really like Leicester's ground, and I don't really base it on how big it is, it's, I mean, if it's very small, then it doesn't help, but it's not about how big it is, it's it's just about how nice it is, and I really, really like Leicester's, but I'll probably put it in good, but not quite brilliant, Arsenal's, they've got comfy seats, it's big, it's, it's amazing, um, Next up, Watford. It helps when you go there a lot. And I feel like, no, I'm going to put it in good because it's my home. That's probably why I'm putting, I'm putting it in brilliant. But no, I'm going to try and stay non-biased and I'm going to put it in good. Tottenham's is brilliant. Insane. I remember when we went there, my dad said to me, this is going to be the best away day. This is going to be the best ground you've ever been to. And he was right. Straight up. Um, walls ground. It's good. It's big. It's not brilliant. That doesn't mean it's bad. Chelsea, I'm going to put in good as well. I've been there 2015 for the FA Cup. I think it holds around 40,000, 50,000. No, it holds more than 40,000. 50, 60,000. It's decent. It's good. Um, Southampton, I've been to many times. I'm going to put it in good. Holds around thirty to 40,000. I think, no, Chelsea holds around 40, 50,000. Southampton holds around 30, 40. Don't get me wrong. Oh, crap. Now, Newcastle's isn't great. And the reason why, the away end is so high up. You don't even... When the ball's... You know when you're so high up, you don't even know whether the ball's on the ground or not. You don't even know if they're going to hit it with their foot or with their head. Like, it's it's too big. Um, What ground have I been to? Brighton. I like Brighton. It's, it's average. It's, like, bigger than ours. I think it's about 27,000, 28,000. And it, it, it's, it's not bad. Actually, I'm going to put it in good. I feel nice. I'm going to put it in good. <laughs> Palace, not great. And I'm not doing this off a of bias, D. It's one of them stadiums where if you go through the turnstiles, you're still outside the ground and it's old. A bit like Everton. It's it's not as bad as Everton, but it's it's not great. <clears throat> now, these are the stadiums. Oh, no, West Ham. Not great. It's a good state. Well, it's a good stadium, but you can't see the pitch. And I'm sure West Ham fans will agree with me. Like their front, if you're sitting at the front, that's kind of like the equivalent, like sitting. Well, possibly even sitting at the back of Vicarage Road. Um. <laughs> anyway, now we're onto the stadiums that I've not been to, but I'm just gonna base it off looks. <laughs> Norwich isn't great. It's decent. Not great. I don't know how much it holds. Um, 
it's one of those stadiums where you just haven't been to. Not the biggest of stadiums. Villa. It's quite big. I'm going to put it in good. I've seen it on telly. It's, it's good. It's not brilliant, but it's not. It's not bad. Sheffield United. It's decent. It's not too small. Not too big or too far away from the pitch. It's not old. I'm going to put them in good. Burnley. I really like Burnley's ground and I don't know why. I don't know why I like it so much. And then City's ground, I'm probably going to put in brilliant. Um, nah, good. Good. And Liverpool's... I'm going to put good as well. So, you could tell I, I, I was... I don't... There was no decent ones in there. Um, I don't know if you could say I was harsh. Oh, crap. Is it still recording? Yeah, it is. <laughs> so, the brilliant ones were United, Arsenal and Tottenham. <clears throat> they are really nice grounds. The the good ones were Leicester, Watford, Wolves, Southampton, City, Chelsea, Brighton, Villa, Sheffield United, Burnley and Liverpool. There weren't any decent ones. The not greats were Newcastle, Palace, West Ham and Norwich. And the awful ones were Everton. Bournemouth. Drop a like if you did enjoy. Don't... Okay, if you disagree, don't necessarily hate on it. Just say you disagree and say where they think they should be. Drop a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.